Hello friends, it's Katie and today's video is going to be a bathroom organization. So last year I did a bathroom tour and this year I'm going to do a bathroom organization because our bathroom's a little chaotic so I'm going to kind of show you the befores and then we'll get into organizing. So this is my sister and I's bathroom and as you can see it's very disorganized right now and it kind of gives me anxiety, I'm not going to lie. Um, it's going to be blamed on my sister because I'm only here nine months out of the year and when I left it was clean. So it's kind of her fault but yeah this definitely needs some work. So that is what we're going to do now. So the first thing that I did was clear off the entire counter and then I wiped it down. I didn't show me wiping it down, but I did. I just cleared off the entire counter and now I'm going to start and make it simple and make sure the only things that are on this counter are the things that we use every day and that are necessary. Okay, so right now it already looks so much better and so much simpler. Um, I put the two bins, Lizzie and I each have our own bins, and I put those there, and then I put the toothbrushes and then my hair products right there. So I also have a bunch of this stuff down here, so we're going to figure out a place for those. So this is Lizzie's drawer and I just emptied out everything and put it on here so now I'm going to organize all of this stuff and then put it back in the drawer and see what we need and what we don't need. So now look at this drawer. So much neater. It is still full, but it's all organized. So this is all her face stuff and lip stuff. So like chapstick and just like a bunch of face stuff. This is all her toothbrush and extra stuff like that. So like floss, mouthwash if she needs it. These are all the hair ties. So but hair ties and barrettes and bobby pins in one place. And it's all right here. And then of course there are her headbands. And so this is so much neater. It looks like it's a lot of stuff and it is because I mean it's our bathroom. But it's definitely organized and you can find things very quickly. Now we are going to look at my drawer and there's not as much stuff and it's pretty organized I'd say. Um, just because I don't really touch this stuff but we'll do that now. So since most of my stuff is at school, we're just kind of putting our extras in this one. So these are just kind of like extra bottles that we don't use that much. So that's just going to stay there. Um, this is all my hair stuff and beauty stuff that I have at home right now. So some brushes and then some other hair stuff. Then I have two different um, hand sanitizers, some Ricola, and some just like gels and face stuff. So that is that drawer. 
Now we are going to tackle all of this. And the first thing that I'm going to do is take out everything, which I like to do when I'm organizing stuff. So take out everything from underneath here and start brand new. So I just did the first side and this is what it looks like. So the toilet paper is there and of course all our feminine stuff is here, which makes sense because, you know, bye bye the toilet. <laughs> um, and then we have all of our uh, lozenges or like cough drops there and then we have Dixie cups which we use a lot so I just put them there. And now we are going to move on to the second side. So now this side is done and it's organized chaos, I would say. This stuff we don't use as much, so we barely touch this stuff except for kind of like these which clean your retainers. But we have some soap here and back here we have nail polish that we really don't use. Um, we have some face wash and then we have extra traveler cases. And then we have um, just kind of like bottles of stuff. So these are all travel stuff that we don't use that much. We have some more dop kits tucked away back here. We have bath and body work stuff that we don't use. Face stuff that's extra. We have my old hair stuff that I still want to keep. Um, more face stuff. And just so it's kind of it's chaos but it's organized and it does look a little cluttered but again it's underneath our sink and we don't really use it that much we don't really see it that much so that's okay with me and it looks so much better than it did before and with that we have concluded my bathroom kind of like reorganization everything i had a lot of fun i just love organizing stuff so i hope you guys enjoyed and i hope this was a fun video and i helped you out organize your bathroom if you guys have any questions please ask as always and i'll see you later bye